What's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network here and today we're going to be talking about Pokémon Tournament and the fact that in Japan it seems like it's not hitting in the arcade scene. There's a lot to talk about with this and there's a lot of reasons that I have in my pocket as well. I read through the article already so I know most of the details but if you don't know, Pokémon Tournament in Japan was released way back in July. Well, not way back I suppose, I mean it was a couple of months ago. So it has had some time to be on the scene. And apparently in Japan, it's not really taken off in the arcades too well. Although, does that really affect the long-term performance of the game? Does that indicate something about the game and when it comes out to the Western audiences? I I'm not sure, but let's take a look at the web browser real quick. Of course, featuring Red Robin by Akai Riot. <laughs> I'm sorry, I love that fucking wallpaper. But anyways, Japan Pokémon Tournament is being pulled from arcades due to unpopularity. Let's run through this real quick. Um, let's just, you know, go through the article and then we'll see exactly what explanations could be possible for this whole thing. So it looks like at least in one arcade, only one, Pokémon Tournament is being removed for not hitting specific benchmarks. The owner of a popular Japanese arcade has announced via their blog and Twitter that they will be removing Pokémon Tournament due to unpopularity. Now, keywords here I suppose are a popular Japanese arcade, but still only a single one. So it might be a really big bustling arcade, but it's it's only one. So you can't judge entirely off of that. But let's go into more detail. The tweets detail that the game is not producing enough income to net out the expense and the removal will come in early November. So, in like a few days, I guess. Um, while the performance in one chain of arcades does not indicate the performance of Pokémon Tournament as a whole, one may wonder if the game is better suited for Western audiences. So, consider this, right? The game's already been out for a while. I was thinking to myself initially, alright, it needs some time for the popularity to catch on. but. One thing that you also have to consider is that in these Japanese arcades, these guys play fucking hardball. Um, a lot of time what they do is they practice on the game at home and then they go to the arcades and they bust their friends' asses on it. And usually, a lot of the time, maybe they spend so much time in the arcades itself that that becomes the main central hub. So. Because Pokémon Tournament is a new game, maybe there's not that many experienced players with it. Of course there isn't, um, except for you know the new guys who are enthusiastic about it. Uh, about it. <laughs> but the competitive play with Pokémon Tournament needs time to catch on, I feel. But it's already had time, and a lot of these Japanese players, they go hard or go home. So the fact that this big arcade is taking it down might just mean something overall in the long run of things. Maybe it is better suited for the Western audiences because over here in the good old US of A and other regions besides Japan, shit has been going down, man. I mean, there have been tournaments about this stuff. D1's been commentating all over them. People are enjoying watching this shit. It's crazy how Pokémon Tournament is doing right now. And the game hasn't even come out in the US yet. So that really gets me wondering, you know, is it really not meant for the Japanese players, which is crazy because this is something that you would think that Japanese players would hook onto. The fighting game scene is massive in Japan, so why didn't this take off? Why is this not running the arcades? This should be one of the most popular machines. This should be banking out, but instead it's doing the worst to the point where they're taking the machine down. And how many machines do they have for Pokémon Tournament in that bitch, I wonder? They probably don't just have one machine. They probably got a ton of them. And all of them as a collective are not doing that well in Japanese arcades. It, it's weird to me. I really don't... I mean, I can, I can sit here giving you bullshit excuses out of my ass all day. But I truly do not understand the concept of why the hell this is not taking off. I mean, it's Pokémon. It's a fighting game. It's in Japan. Are it arcades? And it ain't doing well? Do you, I mean, if you know the research behind the numbers of arcades in Japan, and the fact that in Japan, arcades have remained steadily popular even after they dwindled here in the United States, these numbers would not make sense to you. So, I don't get it myself. Do you have any explanations about why this is the case? I would definitely love to hear them in the comments. Why do you think it is that Pokémon Tournament in Japan is just not soaring in the arcades, it's actually doing horribly in the arcades, and it's being taken down? Um, I need to know what your opinions are because if this is a major big arcade like it's saying it is and it's taking Pokémon Tournament down, then that's got to mean that the smaller arcades, maybe it's being taken down there too or being considered for that. I don't know. Let me know what you think and I will talk to you in the next video. Is this game better suited for the West? It might just be. Take care of yourselves and of course as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.